Hey y'all, so I wanted to make this video. It was just put on my heart to just give somebody these words because I know that I'm not the only one that feels like this, you know? And I was, I've been feeling like, you know, you know how you you feel like things are just taking forever to just happen? Like, you know something's going to happen. You know things are going to change around for you in, in your life, but you just feel like it's not happening fast enough for you. You know what I mean? Like, it, it's okay to have that mindset, but, you know, not everything is on your time, and things aren't supposed to happen whenever you want it to happen. If they happen whenever it's meant for it to happen for you. But I had i was watching this video this morning and she was just saying how like it's it's a time where i'm in my bbb and the bbb stands for i'm at, i'm at a time in life where yes i was bitter yes i was broken but now i'm better <laughs> that in the past don't define of who I am today you know I'm I'm I have grown a lot I have came a far I have come far in in my journey and far in the things that I have learned and understanding that things happen for a reason life is the way that it is for a reason you know like your journey is planned out the way it's planned out for a reason you know it's up to us on how long we allow certain things to happen in our lives you know I said that before but I I I that really touched my heart because it was just like wow like that's God telling me that I need to stand in my power I need to stand in who I am I need to just embrace who I am and if nobody else understands it's not meant for them to understand it's only meant for me to understand you know what I'm saying like things that are meant for you are meant for you and it may feel lonely in that moment, but you're never alone, you know? The divine, your angels, God, they're always protecting. They're always looking over you. They're always making sure that you're good at all times. You just have to trust, have to have faith. You have to believe, you know? Because they don't do the work for you. You have to put in those steps. You have to put in the work in order for them to to continue with protecting you through your journey and through the things that you are learning that, and that the things that they are teaching you. But then it was so crazy because I was sitting there, no fat, get out. Then I was sitting there and my mom had messaged me and she has sent me and my sister this scripture. I don't know the full scripture. I, I can't quote it right now because I'm recording on my phone. But she has sent this scripture and it was like, um, don't be bitter. I seen the, the word bitter in her scripture that she had sent to me. And she didn't even know that I watched this video, y'all. And it was just like confirmation. Like, it was, it was, stop. I am not cutting this out. But it was just like, it was... It was confirmation. It was. It gave me clarity, and it it helped me know that he he was talking to me, and that video was for me. And I I'm just so grateful for God. You know, I'm grateful for my journey. I'm grateful for the things that I have learned in my life, and and that I have allowed myself to overcome. And you know, I always said I am a I'm a different type of human being. You know. Uh, I'm very intuitive. I'm a very intuitive person. I'm an empress. I'm, I'm just, I'm a lot of things. You know what I'm saying? If you know, you know. If you understand, you understand. The ones who get it, get it. And the ones who don't, don't. But I am an empress. And I am so, I am an earth angel. I am a healer. You know, I am a light. I am a star. I'm meant to be bigger than what I am. And I know that now. And I believe it. And I trust in it. And I'm ready for it. And this song just popped up in my head. You know, certain things, certain songs pop up in my head. Just that's how the divine communicates to me. And, you know, my, you know, that's just how music is very significant to me in my life. And the song, It's Not Over Till God Says So, y'all. That song kept popping up in my head all day today. Then whenever I got off of work today, I was driving 
and I was on my way um, coming home and something was just like, you need to listen to that song. And I just kept hearing it in my head and I played it in the car. I don't know who need to hear this, but it's not over till God says so. Whenever I tell you that that is the truth, and that song touched me in a way where I just started crying. Not sad tears. It was happy tears because it's just like, like through all the hard times, through all the confusion, through all the unknown, keep with me, you know, continuously moving forward. Un I'm going into the unknown. <laughs> but I know by me going into the unknown is me knowing what I don't want, <laughs> what I'm not going to accept, what I'm not going to allow myself to go through no more. Because at the end of the day, it's not over till he says so, because I'm listening to what he asks me to do. He is guiding me to do what is best for me. He is guiding me to where I am able to connect with my higher self and be protected through the process of me connecting to my higher self. You know, what I mean like y'all I don't know who need to hear this today but even if you feel like it's hard right now even if you feel like you're not gonna make it you will because you're doing something that that's not that not that you're doing something that most people aren't able to do and I learned that two years ago and and two years uh, I learned that well not two years if, if I'm saying that correctly, basically, you know, it's been two years since I've been on my spiritual journey. And I learned that through those hard times, through those ways, they don't last. Yes, it may be rough through that current, you know what I'm saying? That wave may be tossing you back and forth and you feel like you can't breathe. You feel like you're not going to be able to come up for air. You will because God going to always, he always going to have your back. But you always have to make sure, he has to make sure that you're ready. You, he got to make sure that you're ready for what is about to come for you, okay? Because it's not always, it's not always going to be, it's not always going to be easy. It's not always going to be, it's never going to be easy. Let me just let you know that right now. Like there's, it's going to be some type of. It's going to be some type of difficulty within it. He's never going to make it to where it's so hard to where you ain't going to never going to get it. No, but we do have to learn our lessons. Sometimes we have to pay back our karma or whatever it is that we did that we know that that we know that wasn't good. Not for other people, but for our own selves, because we have to be very mindful that. No matter how much you feel like you want to get back at somebody or do this or do that at the end of the day. You are hurting yourself. <laughs> At the end of the day, you you are showing God where you want to be placed. If you get it, you get it. And I and I have been showing him that I want to be placed with with people who love me, with people who 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 just cherish me for me, who who want to be around me, who want to understand like not even understand me because honestly and truthfully like I'm at a place where I know who I am and nobody can tell me who I am, period. I know who I am. And I know that God, God is the only person who can judge me. God is the only person who can shut that door. God is the only person who can be like, no, Kiara, you can't do that. He's the only one, the only one. Of course, he sends people down here on this physical earth to send you to help guide you do, through different things. But like I said, he sends you those people. Just like, you know, the devil can send you some people too. But at the end of the day, I just want y'all to know that it's just, it's not over and you're going to get through it. We're going to get through this thing called life. And I'm so excited to start back my YouTube. RJ chewed up. If y'all know who RJ is, RJ is my dog. He chewed up my core, y'all, to my computer to charge my, my laptop. So I got to buy me a whole new charger for my laptop. But once I get that, it's... Ain't no stopping us. 2022 was my year. This is my year. This is my time to shine. This is my time to be the best me possible and to sh spread my light and to spread my knowledge and to let people know that I'm just ready. I'm ready. And I, I just, I love the people who actually have still been on my channel and the ones who have still been subscribed to my channel and, and 
just watching my videos i really really honestly and truthfully i appreciate it i don't care if it's just 10 views 11 views at the end of the day it's people who i know that are at a place in their life where they're ready to hear something hear hear real stuff hear things that you know i'm not gonna tell you what you want to hear i'm not i am a messenger and either you take that message or you don't but at the end of the day i can I'm only doing what what my purpose is here to do and and that is to spread my knowledge and and share my story and just I'm just so happy and I want to get emotional on camera cuz you know I just you know you know <laughs> we ain't going to do that not today but I'm just really excited and I really hope that this really helped y'all and let y'all know that no matter what, you can do it. You could do it. No matter whatever you put your mind to, and as long as you want it and you show that you want it and you show that you're ready for that, nothing can stop you. Nobody can stop you but you. You may be in your own way. You may be sitting there blaming somebody else. And it's all you. It's always you. It's never other people. Always remember that. Because you have control over your life. You have control over who you allow to distract you. Who you allow to hold you back. Who you allow to make you angry. To make you all those things. You have that power. And it's just like, and I understand if you that person that has to learn the hard way and have to see it for your own self, because I used to be that person. No judgment over here. I don't judge nobody. I just know that I'm here to let you know that it's possible. And I'm just happy. I'm really excited about this journey. I'm really excited about just the things that are to come. Just wait, y'all. Like, just wait on it. Like, it's about to be lit, but... I love y'all. I love y'all so, so much. I hope y'all have an amazing night. I hope y'all do some self-care today. Listen to listen to that song, It's Not Over Till God Says So. I think it's um, by Is Israel, if I'm not mistaken, Adrian Ballon's um, husband. Yeah, Israel, Israel. I think that's how you pronounce it. But listen to that song, y'all, and just it's, it's going to help you have a way better day today and or night. But I love y'all and I hope y'all have an amazing night. Bye.